What's up, guys? It's your boy Trump. So, again, we're here back with more Jumps out there. Great Adventures of Mystery Mountain. This is episode 36. We've already gotten Rolling Robot, a Rolling Robot, for uh, the fourth disc. Let's see what we get to rescue next. Or get started with, anyway. No time to pat ourselves on the back. Select another question so we can save another robot. Or that, let's hear the response. Eh, been there, done that. Pick a mission. The world's first vehicle was nothing but a plank of wood dragged behind an ox. The invention of the wheel changed history forever because it turned that sluggish sled into a swift cart. But the first wheel wasn't invented for moving people. What was the first wheel used for? Obviously, Miss Winkle, to drive around, you first need something to steer with. Ipso facto, therefore ergo, the steering wheel had to come first. True, Miss Winkle? You got a flat tire on that question, Polly. Nah. The first wheel was probably invented not for transportation, but for making pottery. The potter's wheel allowed the Sumerians to spin pots into perfectly round shapes. Wheeled carts soon followed. Think of each one of those right, glowing buttons yeah. as representing a poor, lost, and scared robot. We can't go back to an old mission when there's so much at stake. Okay, great. Let's see. Hmm. I pick the middle one. If you try to trace the invention of the bicycle back to its very beginnings, ooh, you run into a bit of trouble. The ancient Egyptians built two wheeled contraptions out of wood, but no one knows for sure if they used them as bikes. The Egyptian bikes had no pedals, and neither did the first modern bikes. So, how were the first modern bicycles powered? Who needs pedals when you've got jet engines on your bike? The jet engine bicycle was so totally cool that they invented pedal bikes on purpose because parents could never catch their children at dinner time. Oh my god, Polly. Pedaling has its pleasures, Polly, but you're right about the world's first bikes. They were propelled by jet engines. Unfortunately, no examples of these first bicycles survived. The bicycles and their riders all disappeared into the sky. Oh no, Polly's rigged the world's first bicycle with jet engines. That means everyone who rides one shoots off into the sky never to be heard from again. We must do something to save the world's first bike riders and the poor people in their paths. Click on the inventory button to put away the transquizzer. You ain't kidding, kid. If they go zooming off into the sky, well, they'll probably just burn up in the intense heat of the sun. Sheesh. Not so fast, Buster. I've sent Boosterbot, the rocket robot, to a place in time that's a secret known only by me. You can attempt to find out where that is, but first you'll have to find these four clues. A drum, blue jeans, a pretzel, and roller skates. Hmm. All right. So Polly's reprogrammed Boosterbot. He knows everything there is to know about rocketry. I say we let the air out of Polly's tires, so to speak, and rescue Boosterbot and the world's first bike rider. Keep still while I sense around for clues. Good luck with that. Bingo! I've sensed a mission clue in the painting gallery. All right, we'll get that started in just a second, guys. Okay, our first clue is in the painting gallery, so let's go there, pronto. Feel like browsing through the virtual collection? Just click on the machine. Or go to the gallery in the back if you feel like creating your own work. Amazing. Just make sure you leave everything the way you find it. Not like Polly, always creating a mess. My gut feeling is that there's a clue in the painting gallery. It's right behind me. All right, then let's hit it. Here we are in the painting gallery. Any sign of Polly? Okay, Clotly. If you want the mission clue I hid here, either you or your friend better paint me a picture. Okay, Picasso, paint this. She is asking for it one of these days. She is just fucking asking for it. A girl cartwheels. The girl just kept on twirling down the alien highway. She didn't even stop for the rat. The air was filled with a mysterious buzzing sound, like flies. The gallery's filled. No, it's not. We need to give Polly exactly what she asks for. 
Alien Highway, huh? Okay, there's two pieces of this done. Very serious puzzle kind of like flies, huh? Fair enough. Let's slap those in here. Yeah. Mm, beautiful job. Bingo. Just pick up the clue and add it to the inventory. I am so good. Yes! What an artist! No mission clues here. Let's try another floor. Roger that. But we at least got one piece of the puzzle done, so we'll be back to see what awaits us next in just a moment. Okay, you know how I said we go to see what awaits us next? First, we're gonna power up, so we don't have to deal with that problem. We don't have to deal with that problem later, see? I'm gonna go power up. Time to power up! Pick the right batteries and plug them in! Yeah, this is child's play. 10 plus 7, 17. 11 plus 11 is 22. 10 and 10 is 20. It's child's play. It's at level 1 right now. I don't know why it switched from level 2 to level 1, but I ain't complaining about it. I ain't about to complain. Complain about a gift would be just silly. Way to go! You've completed the first ring. But you gotta hurry. You still have to get through the second ring. Yeah, I know. Anyone can figure that out. Bada bing, bada boom. 11 and 10 is 21. Yeah, this is really challenging. Really freaking challenging. That's what this is. Uh huh. 10 and 1 is 11. 4 and 4 is 8. 12 and 11 is 23. 10 and 9 is 19. And 3 and 1 is 4. Kaboom. Great job! Now hold on! Wasn't that cool? That was some jolt. We've got 100% energy now, so let's go save the world. This floor Indeed, is empty. Let's, let's try save another the world. world. Right after this. Right after this commercial break. Okay, we're all charged up. Let's hit the um, let's hit the music hall just to get some action. Of course, the door is locked again. We'll have to get Beethoven to give us a hand with the password. I'm not totally, totally deaf, deaf, you know. know. Just let me know, know if you, you need, need a few pointers. pointers. <laughs> Walk in these. Oh, shoes. Shoes. You've got a real talent for this. Socks, obviously. Socks. Terrific. We're almost in. Off your back. Shirts. Great job. You're better at this than I am. Yes, I know I'm better than you. You have to tell me what I already know. Gloves. You figured out all four words. Now, can you unscramble the password? Of course I can. It's close. Yes. 
Yes, the password is clothes. Hey, you got us in the door. Let's go. I hate to start this off on a sour note, but... Polly! Okay, for that little insult, I'll give you invention points only if you can play this piece. And I want it played perfectly, with feeling. Oh boy, she does Click. something. The music oh, it's only four pieces this time? Makes it much easier for me. Right back to solve this guys. Okay, let's tackle this son of a bitch. Wait a second. Yeah, that one's going first, obviously. Okay, it's either the third one or the bottom of the other one. Let's check it out. We got it, we got it, we got it. We got it, guys. Yeah, we got this one. We got it, we got it, we got it. We got it. This is all good. It's gonna be just fine. We've got this son of a bitch. Give me those invention points. I know I got it. You did it! You damn right I did it. This beautiful song is called Amazing Grace. Amazing Grace. <laughs> I don't even know the lyrics, so don't ask me what they are. <clears throat> give me those points. Better she's not give me the goddamn points. Invention points in your inventory before tears make me all rusty. 
Okay, there aren't any mission right. clues on this floor. Let's go see another floor. Sweet. We're re ready to do this and do that in just a sec, probably. Okay, our clues in the street machine room, so let's go get it. As you see, we have 1,266 points because I started with a ping pong. But here we are, it. back at the shrink o -Matic. I'm here to help if you need me. Remember Polly's hint. Find the small specimen with two antennae. Choose carefully. I already know what it is. I think that's the right. Happy trails. Later! Later! <laughs> it's robot ping pong time. Not that I don't... And also, guys, I will be playing um, more classic games like Backyard Soccer MLS Edition and Robots Munchkin Land that are too classic for me. But you guys are probably wondering, how would I trick the system into playing a game that old for me? <clears throat> it's very simple. It's just how I did for uh, Backyard Soccer. That's neither here nor there because I don't have the disc to be able to play those games right now. But I'll be getting them in the very near future so we can play these games. But right now, it's Robot Ping Pong time to get that clue. Key. You gotta play robot ping pong to get that clue. So far, he's bouncing around like, well, a ping pong ball. That's what he is right now. He's a robotic ping pong ball. Whoops. Alright, we'll be right back. Okay, let's continue this game of robot ping pong. You never know where he's gonna shoot out of next. Oh, and by the way, Polly's hint for this clue was that Egbert uses this specimen to get better reception on a TV. And Egbert's like, actually, I have a satellite dish. So yeah, that was the actual clue. Because of the game game. You guys can hear that. Here it comes! Indeed. Off he goes. Mr. Ping Pong Man. I thought it wasn't fair, it was right through the hole. Okay, that's twice it's, it's redirected it in the wrong way. Come on, stay on target, Batley! He's on target with the pink one. Was, but now he's not on target for anything. Yes. I love the music in this level, by the way. It's like, woo! All the, all the creepiest fuck music soundtrack. <laughs> Next one should be the charm. Okay, now it will be. There's literally nothing left to hit. How did he miss it? He missed it not once, but twice. Got it. That's it. Take the clue and put it in your inventory. Then, on to complete this mission. Indeed, let's get the heck out of here. 
let's move on. There's no mission clue here. Yeah, well, we'll be moving on and getting the final two clues in our next episode, guys. So until next time, it's your boy Charm City my son out. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe to join the Charmin Nation today. Till next time, peace out, everybody.